in this video let's see how to use performance analyzer in power bi desktop to examine the performance of power bi desktop power bi performance analyzer is a future included in the may 2019 release of power bi desktop which provides a few insights about the time consumed in other activities such as the rendering time of any visuals now let's see how to use performance analyzer in power bi desktop you can enable the power bi performance analyzer by clicking the performance analyzer check box in the view tab you can go to performance analyzer performance analyzer measures the processing time required to update report elements initiated as a result of any user interaction that results in running a query to have performance analyzer begin recording simply select the start recording over here so it will start recording the actions whatever you are doing in this report so let me click on start recording now any actions you take in this report are displayed and logged in the performance analyzer pan over here in the order that the visual is loaded by power bi for example you have a report that users have said takes is long time to refresh then performance analyzer can tell you which visual is taking the longest duration to get process once you start recording the start recording button is grayed and the stop button is active if you notice here the stop button is get active let me interact with this measure so here performance analyzer collects and displays the performance measurement information in real time and now if you notice here you are getting the name of the object or visual and what is the duration it is taking for this called as performance duration it is in milliseconds if you don't want this you can clear it off you can select a refresh visuals in the performance analyzer pan to refresh all visuals on the current page of the report and now let me click on refresh visuals and now if you see for text box it is taking 49 milliseconds and if you are not sure this slicer belongs to which slicer then you can click on this slicer and now you can see that particular slicer got highlighted if you want to stop the recording if you can click on stop recording so that the recording will get stopped and you can save the information that performance analyzer creates about your report by selecting the export button selecting a export creates a dot json file over here with information from the performance analyzer pan and you can save it here i have created here two slicers one is for year and another one is for quarter and i have used the list format in this now let me start recording once i start recording i will start interacting with this slicer so once i click on any slicer over here and here if you notice here we have three components or categories which is dax query visual display and other dax query it contains 14 milliseconds visual display it contains 40 milliseconds and for other it took 381 milliseconds now let's see how to improve this slicer performance and you can improve this slicer performance by using the drop down method for changing that you can click on this arrow mark and here instead of list you can choose drop down over here i have created a separate page for that let me click on that here if you notice here i have used the drop down for both slicers let me clear this performance analyzer and let me interact with this here and here it is not recording now so let me interact here so let me go to 2018 so once i click on 2018 here the logging informations are ready now if you click on this slicer and here you will be not seeing the dax query here because if you are using the drop down then it will not take dax query and here if you go and click on this quarterly sales it will take some time to display the visuals but if you go to this page 
it will show you these slicers immediately it will not take much time and if you go and see in the performance analyzer even here also for dax query it is not taking much time for slicers this is how we can improve the power bi slicer performance in power bi reports to watch more videos like this visit our official youtube channel petaka technologies to book your slot for online training visit our official website petakatechnologies.com to get notifications on new upcoming videos subscribe to this channel and activate bell icon that's all for this video thanks for watching